place in score for five years consistently. Coming into score, it was always me and Max, uh, you know, racing and trying to get on teams together and kind of doing everything together. So that's kind of where we came from. And then we got, we got pretty lucky with THR wanting to support us through 2014. And that's kind of when it all happened. When I first started just desert racing in general, I was always looking up to Mikey Childress, Johnny Campbell, and then I got a little bit more into the sport and I started looking up to Kirk Caselli and Rossler and Andy Greider, just I wanted to be like them. I was waiting to get their age so I could race with them, but then I soon realized that we all just get old and now I can't race with them, so. <laughs> you know, R Ricky Brabeck is a good friend to me now. He's an idol, he's an idol to my son. The dude is on fire right now, he's, he's badass and, and I enjoy having him as my partner racing in Mexico and racing the Heron Hounds together and he helps me out in my weak spots. We train together and just all around we hang out, we get along, we share the same thoughts on the course and pre-running ideas and everything else so our partnership works out really well. My favorite thing about racing in Baja is the locals and pre-running. Every time you pre-run something, something happens to you. I, I've Ran out of gas a few times, crashing, uh, blown corners, light problems, and the race goes by so quick that you don't really remember the race. You remember more of the pre-running and, and hanging out with your friends, so that's, that's the part I really enjoy. Ricky has come on the scene really quick. He rode with us two years on our 21 team. Uh, we won in nearly uh, every race we entered. I might be a little biased, because he's one of our uh, athletes, but to me, he's possibly the fastest desert racer in the world at the moment. The next five to six years in score racing, I would like to see myself and the, the team I'm with right now still, still winning, still racing in, in Ba. Ba to me is, is fun. It's, it's, an, it's an adventure just like life. Uh, every time you go down there, you see something new. Racing in Baja is not easy. There's, there's so many problems that you can have, and it, I think it just comes down to who makes the least mistakes. So this year, it's gonna come down to the thousand again, and hopefully we make the least amount of mistakes and we can pull it off.